In a practice not seen often, Maha Ganapati was invoked in a Brahmachari. A puja was duly performed after which the Purnahuti continued in the Jagat Guru's presence. Jagat Guru gave an Anugraha Bhashanam on this occasion, after which the final offerings were made in the Homakunda. The Sri Chamakam was chanted while the offerings were being made. Everything that a person would need for a good life in order to pursue dharma is thought of and the devatas are requested to bestow it upon us in this chamakam. It is important to remember that we need to ask devatas for specifics but then our ask is for the improvement of the self, not selfishness. When we are able to live a healthy life, when we have enough money and comforts, we are able to give back to society, follow Sanatana Dharma and make it truly Sanatanam without ending, where we pass it on from generation to generation through the millennia like it has come to us. Jagat Guru then went to the Yagashala and offered flowers to the Mahaganapati there before performing a pradakshina and then accepting the prasadams and distributing them amongst the bhaktas who were gathered. This concluded the seven day long Laksha Modaka Mahaganapati Havan held at Kashi. Do subscribe to our channels, hit the like button and get notified when new videos are uploaded.